वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू एम जी एजुकेशन now we are going to study about the narratives of travelers considered by samuel johnson it is dedicated plus 3 core 3 english students now this is an essay written by samuel johnson a poet a play writer an essayist a critic and an editor Who was born in 1709 in london in 18th century he is highly noted for the art of writing different literature subjects now this essay narratives of travelers considered is quite interesting and valuable for one and all here he had studied the accounts of the travelers which has been published by various journals which johnson studied that quite dissatisfied him out of this satisfaction he found the shortcomings in the accounts of the travelers and wanted that it should be rectified for the benefit of the readers right why do we go through the accounts of travelers the answer is quite clear that we want to gather some information relating to place and the cultural activities social economic conditions of a particular place he or she has visited but here samuel johnson was quite dissatisfied to place the reasons that the accounts maintained by the travelers are not quite satisfactory he stated the reasons they are not data based uh, you know and contain very less information secondly lacking right information you can write like this also and the third one it is not educative to the readers rather it is very entertained just describing about the landscape scenery shots hills mountains okay casuals places roads mountains deserts valleys etc focusing on its more geography than its history it's less useful he is dissatisfied for this so the third point is it lacks benefits of art and the fifth point is it lacks distinct idea of the place and history as i have already told you it focused more on geography than that of the history he said the greater part of you know travelers what coverage they have given tells nothing because their method yeah their method of traveling supplies them with nothing nothing to be told his dissatisfaction was uh, uh, rather um, focused for entertainment here his means the travelers who you know maintain the account uh, he said one should focus on the information on landscape sceneries and churches whatever they visit with its complete information and uh, history so that the reader can take some benefits out of it uh, moreover samuel johnson complained why should why should the travelers uh, record e- expeditions by which nothing could be nothing could be collected okay then it shows no knowledge no knowledge regarding the place that was his cause of dissatisfaction johnson also mentions that one on certain day he set out early in the first hours of march 
towards the south and tells us about uh, the hills covered with the trees the streams uh, running towards north and casuals with the tower and then he speaks uh, of the road and of uh, countryside valleys deserts mountains uh, which offered them neither good supplies nor specific lodging so in this way he uh, means found out the defects in the accounts that the travelers has narrated in their travel history moreover samuel johnson wanted that his readers uh, who should go through these narrative travelers uh, uh, writings he should be aware of certain things regarding the incidents and with some reflection of the place the reader when go through his narratives he must gain his uh, company for another day will dismiss him again therefore he wanted that the narrators must uh, not just focus on the hills mountains rocks or relics rather than it their accounts must be informative the more informative it is and the more useful to the readers moreover by this they can compare the their state with that of others their requirements and other several things which will benefit the reader in the last paragraph of the essay johnson tells that the travel history would be a document less entertained but more educated it should be more educated it should be more uh, informative so to say <clears throat> the greater objective here is to provide knowledge to the reader about every nation every culture every economy and the surroundings uh, something special or genius which should be exposed from their account so that uh, the reader can satisfy himself and it can promote other countries then only he can be said as a useful traveler who covers these points in his travel history okay so he focuses much on the clear cut information that should be generated out of the writing out of the pen of a, a narrator right in conclusion you can say like this or you can write like this that the to sum up uh, the main points of the essay it is clear that the traveler should avoid unnecessary datas and unuseful uh, informations as well as entertainment portion uh, rather he should focus uh, in his narration certain other things which are worthy for the readers valuable for the re readers with a set of good information and knowledge which will benefit the reader otherwise all these things are in no way useful uh, dear students watch it carefully again and again uh, listen and uh, make a brief notes
so for the coverages are concerned the point number one is samuel johnson's dissatisfaction regarding the uh, narration of the travelers about the places they visit the second point is about the causes why he dissatisfied what things are lacking in their traveling account uh, third thing he suggested what should be mentioned what should not and what will benefit the readers what not accordingly a traveler should mention in his narration so it must be more educative his suggestion is that it must be more educative it must be more informative in the sense that it can give some knowledge to the readers regarding their nation their culture their economy their history and etc rather than physically describing the sceneries and beautiful scenes and surroundings of course it is needed but he provided a secondary importance to this and given primary importance to the information and knowledge what he want to say to the travelers or the narrators or the the narrative skills that they adopt must be considered properly so he titled it narratives of the travelers considered so students this is also very important concept for you those who are in english honors okay so this is code 3 code 3 of english honors candidates thank you very much and watch and subscribe it so that in the next video i will cover uh, your the most difficult part of the english honors course that is the six papers of it uh, yeah it's really noteworthy if you can uh, learn it from it and uh, i dedicate myself for the students of english honors thank you very much for watching thank you very much